Knight Rider, a shadowy flight into the dangerous world of a man who does not exist. Michael Knight, a young loner on a crusade to champion the cause of the innocent, the helpless, the powerless, in a world of criminals who operate above the law. Flag mainframe. Kit, old buddy, you reading me? Loud and clear, Michael. Powered up and ready. Okay, pal. Bonnie wants to run a full systems check before we go out on the next assignment. Come to the semi, because teacher won't let us go till we get these tests over with. On my way, Michael. Good morning, Kit. We'll run a few field tests to see if the new systems upgrades work properly and recalibrate them where needed. We'll start the test with some basic speed driving around the track. I want you to complete a track in the time displayed on your screen. If you fail, I'd like you to keep on trying until you've recalibrated yourself, so that you can make the time. Yes, Bonnie. That shouldn't be a problem. Remember, your exterior is protected by the molecular bonded shell, but that won't stop your systems from taking impact damage. Great work, kid. Please return to the semi. I've reactivated your ski mode, kid. I'd like you please to proceed to the inner area of the test facility and use ski mode to reach the designated area. Well done. Ski mode seems to be working fine. Please return to the SAMI for the next test. I've reactivated your turbo boost. This will allow you to jump over walls and over great distances. The height of your jump will always be about the same, but the length of the jump will be determined by your speed. Reach the designated area on the inner area of the test facility. Okay, Kit, you heard the lady. Show her what you got. Well done. Turbo Boost seems to be working fine. Please return to the semi for the next test. This is the scanning test. Scan the buildings using medial scans and locate the computer. On finding the computer, new instructions will follow. Good work. Now, use the interstitial scan on the computer to download the data on it. Keep in mind that the interstitial scan has a very limited range. Well done. Please return to the semi. Okay, this is the final test. I've activated the obstacle course and I want you to complete the track within the time shown on your head-up display. Well done, you've passed all tests. You are ready for active service again. Told you we didn't need these tests. Mission successful. I've just heard there's been a bank robbery in a town quite nearby. Apparently a large sum of money was loaded onto a modified getaway vehicle, which the police cannot keep up with. The vehicle is heading this way, and I would like you and Kit to stop it. Finally, some action. We're on our way. Kit, let's hit it. If you mean hurry, Michael, then I concur. The getaway car had just passed us at 120 miles per hour. We're going to be hard-pressed to keep it within sensor range. Indeed, the robbers and the money are both secured. Mission successful. Let's get to that bank, Kit. Okay, we're here. Let's scan for clues. Michael. Someone is remotely downloading the data stored on this device, replacing it with static in the process. So that's why no clues were ever found. Can you trace where the signal's coming from? Yes, I've located it. Displaying. Let's get over there before all the data's lost. I've traced the data transmission to the car back there. 
He has the information we want, Michael. We'll deal with him later. First, these. Mission successful. He's destroying the original data. We should stop him as quickly as possible. Okay, kid, disable them any way you can, but don't let any bystanders get hurt. Great work, buddy. Let's scan for clues. I've got what is left, but can't use it directly. It will need to be reconstructed at the semi. Okay, before we get to that, though, where was the car heading? I detect a building to the northwest registered in the name of G Industries. I would estimate there is a 99.37% likelihood that... Way ahead of you, buddy. Let's call it a dead cert and get over there. Looks like a machine shop. This must be where they fitted out those souped-up getaway cars. Yes, and my scan picked up something else. I detected certain very rare chemicals used for only one purpose. What's that? Those are the chemicals used in my own construction. Michael, this is where they've been applying the molecular bonded shell. And from the size of this building, they've used it to construct something much bigger than any normal car. Let's get back to the semi. Devin needs to know about this right away. We must hurry indeed, Michael. I found a malicious virus active in the downloaded data, which is slowly deleting the recording. Step on it! Mission successful. Devin and Bonnie are still reconstructing the data from the camera we retrieved. Meanwhile, Devin wants us to investigate G Industries. I've checked all my databases, but can't find anything except that it appeared out of nowhere two years ago, and it's now one of the biggest companies in the region. It's Sunday today. A good day for snooping around. Bought me a course, Kit. There's a computer in there. Can you download the data? No, Michael. I am out of range for downloading, so we must get closer. Okay, let's find a way to get you in downloading range, without being detected. Security breached. Self-destruct sequence initiated. Destroy the compound. How much time, buddy? Just playing now, Michael. Wow! Hey, your buddy! Okay, it's close enough, and I don't trust it. We'll check it out first. Kit, plot me a course. Kit, can you tell me what the signal is? Yes, Michael. It's a message on the Flag Secure channel. The frequency signature is a mirror of my own. It's my prototype. Car. What? First Garth Knight is back, and now Car shows up as well? You must be surprised to hear from me. No kidding, Car. You were smeared across three states last time we saw you. Michael, rebuilding car must have taken considerable resources. Who do we? That isn't the question, Kit. What should concern you is that I have a friend of yours here with me. Michael! What? Bonnie, are you okay? I'm fine. Just annoyed I was taken in. I thought he was Kit, so I... Nothing will happen to her. That is... If you decide to meet me at this location, I've set the time that I could cover the distance, Kit. If you're as good as I am, then she will live. Otherwise... Car, Bonnie programmed you. She programmed both of us. You wouldn't hurt her. In my case, she omitted the directive to preserve a human life. A fatal weakness that she chose to give to you. That is the principle behind making a prototype of car, so that those oversights can be corrected in later models. You'd better hurry, Kit. The clock is ticking. Mission successful.
We're here. Let Bonnie go. All in good time, Michael Knight. As Othello's counselor said, how poor are they that have not patience. You said you'd release her if we beat your time limit. That was not what I said. I only told you she wouldn't die yet. I'll release her on my conditions. Which are? Simple. I challenge Kit to a race around the flag test track here. If you win, I'll release Dr. Barstow. If you lose, I will seal myself airtight and remove the air from the passenger compartment, and Dr. Barstow will suffocate. Michael, Carr and I are virtually the same. Our only difference is in programming. He is not bound to protect human life as I am. Racing him with these stakes could prove disastrous. Carr, you're on. Okay, Kit. We'll both drive with human ballast. Ballast? Meet me at the finish line. back, pal. Let's just stay alert. Isn't. Get scanning, Bell. We need to find out if he has any weak spots in his armor plating. Only steer clear of him while you do it, okay? Don't worry, Michael. I intend to. My molecular bondage shuttle is operational again. Try to take weak spots on his sides. Let's hit him there. Mission successful. Stay on his tail, Kit. He can't hide in this canyon forever. As soon as he leaves it, he'll appear on Flag's radar. We now know where Garth's helicopter has landed. Meanwhile, if you'd like to return to the semi, Bonnie has the components required to install Kit's Super Pursuit mode. Mission successful.
Michael, I've had Bonnie feed the flight data into Kit's computer. His sensors will guide you to the landing zone of the chopper. You better drive over there as fast as possible. If Garth refuels and takes off again, we'll never be able to catch him. We're on our way. Kit, get us to that landing zone. ASAP. Yes, Michael. He won't be going anywhere soon. Check if Garth is on board. There's no one on board, Michael. He has to be around here somewhere. The chopper only landed a few minutes ago. In which case, we ought to be able to find him. This building appears to be magnetically shielded. You mean that you can't scan it? That's correct, Michael. My scans cannot get through the phased magnetic field. Hmm. Looks like someone has something to hide. That just makes me want to get inside and take a look. We're in. Can your scanners pick up anything now? Just a minute, Michael. What is it? Someone here? A single individual on the floor above us. Well, what are you waiting for? Mission successful. chopper here now, though. Let's see what else we can find. What's that? It appears to be an elevator leading to a construction shaft, Michael. And a very impressive size. I believe it must run right out under the ocean bed. Garth certainly plans things on a grand scale. Let's see where it leads. Michael Knight, you should be dead by now. Turn back, or you will be. We've been detected. Yes, Michael. And the alarm has triggered the flood doors. We have a choice. Turn back now go on and risk getting trapped under the seabed. Port on, Kit. I'm not giving up now. No such luck, Garth. to make this quick. Mission successful. Garth, give it up. You're beat. This thing is gonna blow any minute. My scan shows that Kara's systems are down. He isn't going anywhere. At least I'll have the satisfaction of watching you die. Michael, I'm reading a 